<laughs> right, so here we are with a quick video tour for you all. So we're starting this tour off in the car park, which is an exciting place to be, <coughs> especially if you're parking your car. But um, normally, you're starting here because the barrier's down. Here's the barrier. Yeah, so the barrier's up at the minute, but um, normally, what? Speak when spoken, so. <laughs> so normally we start here in the car park. So you, you come in through the check-in, check-in obviously, through the check-in, and then you park up here. And then we normally go into the, what's called the Jardin de Sports, which is this building here. So we're gonna go there first and show you what's in there. Obviously you're not um, bound to go there, but that's where we normally go to, because it's nearest to the car park. You can have a drink, which is the most important thing. Okay, so off we go to that bit. Right, so it's really just a short walk down here, a couple of minutes. Um, you can't walk many bikes in a minute, but um, straight into this bit. And if you've got a bike, you can park it, but you won't have a door thing to start with, so we're just going to park up here and have a walk inside for you. Here we are, we're just going into the Jardin de Sports, which is French for Garden of Sports. So, once you get inside, there's face painting here for Jamie to have a go on. <laughs> a lot of arcades and stuff down at the bottom. But it's oh, we'll mention that later on. There's a gym at the bottom, but we'll worry about that bit because you're not here to go to the gym. The Starbucks there, if you want to grab a cup. I'm down near the commentary, you'll just bloody walk behind me. The jewels. And then down here. So yeah, I've got one of these badminton or nice badminton. You can do badminton and roller skating. All oh, right, so not at the same time. Well, obviously, that would be a bit awkward, wouldn't it? Yeah. <laughs> obviously. So here's the mini set up for badminton, but um, as well as having to do roller skating as well. There's also a climbing wall further down and more badminton courts. But we're just going to carry on walking down. Follow me, child. So this is the sport for this. If you want to book any activities, you check in there. Otherwise, you're into the sports bar. Yeah, what? Down here. Pull there. So, this is the entrance. Alright, yeah, Bella. Toilets there. Bella. The most important, yeah, toilets. So, there's all the climbing stuff down here. Bit of a virtual reality experience in there, which looks absolutely amazing. <laughs> no? Ooh. Ooh, yeah. Ooh. So that's the first bit. Um, back around to the bar bit, which is the most exciting part. Hello, oh, flight to West Coast. So here we are. What? Yeah, I'm in a farm pine. Yeah, crash on the farm pine. <laughs> okay. Why? I thought you were doing a little bit. Oh, yeah, you have a little bit. What should we have? Everything. Okay, so we've got our drinks, which is the most important bit you do when you first come here. Now at the minute it's quite empty, but when you arrive it's normally quite busy, but just sit at the table and we'll come and serve you. It's a big screen there. Obviously you can see that's quite a big screen, isn't it? And then there's a little play area here for, for Jamie to have a go in. I like that. Um, and we've got some arcades. A few arcades in here. Now, the only thing with all these, they don't take pound coins or anything. So what you got to do, you got to rob a bank. <laughs> and basically, it's 10 quid for 10 tokens. Now, when we first got here, we thought, we're not going to use them, are we? But you will do through the week, so. Ten are in there, then everything's pretty much a token to go into it. So, so that's that. So that one's there. More games there. Yeah, I'll get to that. Some smaller games there. And through the back bit, we've got some pool tables. Silk table.
So you've got three small pool tables, two of the large American pool style tables, and a lot of table tennis. And then what else we got in here? Oh, bowling, haven't we? Yeah. Whoa. So yeah, we've also got six lanes of bowling. In the jar in the spots. We'll just take you back outside now. <laughs> right, so we're just taking you to the outside area in the Jardin de Sports. So. <laughs> so, uh, I don't know, I'm just getting me get the tail for shot. So, outside, so there's a nice area outside. But um, when you come, it's probably going to be a bit warmer. So I mean, it's quite warm now, isn't it? But it's raining. All right, put your coat on there. But down here we've got some tennis courts, and then there's a big play area down here. Hey, we've got the glasses, haven't we? <laughs> Stuff got glasses. Hey, there you go. Big adventure play area. And then tennis, but we better think, finish a drink first, haven't we? And then <laughs> we'll go back inside. That'll go up this way. Okay, while we're sat here just enjoying a quick um, breather, Bella's asked to just talk about the um, the bands, which is uh, this side getting to your villa, which is the most exciting thing you're going to see this side of Christmas. And you got anything else to add to that? No, but you know, it's very useful and important and in important information. Yes. Like the toilets, you know, these are things that you actually need to know. Yes. Anyway. <laughs> There you go. So, the other side of this little play gym area there, we've got a bit of crown green bowling. You fancy that? And that's really it at the yard in the spot. So, I'm just going to head back, get the bikes up, and uh, we'll show you where the, the bike places are where you can actually hire bikes and stuff. That's coming up next. Right, so we're just coming out of the uh, Jardin de Sports. You can go straight across here. This is a guest um, services bit there if you've got any questions about anything. Not that they're not going to jam knowledge, but um, anything centre parks will be okay. So up here is the... Uh, <laughs> up here is the, uh, the cycle centre. It's just round there. So we're just going to pop in the no entry sign, obviously, that's where you go. And just have to see if we can get some priceless for you so you can see what's what. So here's the cycle prices. So if you want to get an adult bike for the week, it's 53 quid. Kids ones are 40 quid. And the weekends so 40 quid. So you get electric ones as well, like 89 quid. So yeah, it's shut to the minute, but um, this is where you grab your bikes from. Few selections then to show you what you could have won. And once you've got them, you're free to go off into the centre parks world. Right, so we're just coming down from the bike place. And we're gonna go right here, right Bella. And there's a big bike park at the bottom here. So we're just gonna stick the bikes into this one and show you around the uh, the village a bit, they call it. We've just seen some uh, segways go past us, so uh, that's another thing you can do if you're that way inclined. You can hire segways. <laughs> okay, so we're uh, in the village again. Hey, you brought what? Us. There's another Starbucks there. That used to be a Starbucks, and now it's not. So this is the what they call the village of it here. So there's a treats in a sweet shop. It's obviously all low calorie stuff in there, which is great. And the dome you can see in front of us there, that is where all the water parks are. A 
and up there we've got there's another ball and alley we'll go up there on the way back round and that's the dome of the uh, subtropical paradise so let's go to some sun which has been well as flies isn't it so this is the uh the center of the village a bit here so there's a bit of a market there which will rob you blind so you get everything you need there's a kids shop up there another shop behind it and then hooks down at the top so yeah Cafe Rouge here, I've never been there once, but anyway, we'll talk about more. So the curry house at the top there, and Bella Italia, a little Italian there, and then we'll go and show you. Oh, down there is the entrance to the water park, and then just going to see if we can show you the water park. I think we can do. I'll make your way past the 300,000 buggies. Sneak this window, we can show you inside. Look, so yeah, there we go. All the stuff inside subtropical paradise and slides galore. There we go, that's the village. And back to the bike. Nearly forgot, let's show you inside. This is the bowling bit in here, another bowling section. I'll just be in there this afternoon. So there the slide you can see. Another little arcade area. In the bar. Slides up there. Oh. Right, so we've just left the uh, the bike park there, going around round, round the roundabout. Forgot to mention, if you go left up there, that takes you back past the Jardin Sports and to the way out. But then you also pass the Aquasana, which is the uh, the spa, which you might fancy. Uh, Day. I think it's worth going. Me and Bella went and won't really up our street, but um, but yeah, it's good good for a little pamper session. So right, off to the uh, we're going up to the country club now. So we'll uh, check back in a minute. Right, so we cross this little bridge, and this is going to take us past the lake. But um, everywhere you go, there's no cars allowed, so it's great for bikes. And not getting run over. Right, so here we are at the top side of the lake. Stop here a minute. There we go. So it's like everything's finished for the day. There's a, you can make out the zip wire there that goes across the lake, if you fancy that. And then a little beach area over, over there, which we'll go to shortly. The Pancake House. We're just stopping in the place. That's a little, little beach area over there. So we're uh, like halfway up to the uh, country club. So off we go up here. We get to the top of the road. We're gonna go straight across. And just follow this path for about half a mile and then we'll show you where we'll get to. Right, so we just come into the country club and the la lake at the side. I don't think I can walk around that. I just want to walk through it, but um, yeah, so here we are. The country club. So we've got some more tennis courts to the right. 
a little maze area here if you want to get lost for a few hours. And you just keep going, Bella. You park outside it. Another bike park, funnily enough. And there we are, the country club. I'll have a walk around the inside to show you that. We've also got a little, um, little golf, little put in area. This is where Parker's bikes. Alright, so outside the country club, we've got the nature centre over there. There's another little playground area there. Let's have a walk around it. You ready? Alright, let's have a walk inside. Everybody's outside. It's open and uh, so yeah, nice place to come for a, a meal up here. The tables go on, yeah. And they've also got down there. If you're still feeling active, we've got a squash court and at the far little corner and some pool tables around there. So. Nice place to come. Toilets around there. Toilets around there. Thank you, Bella. Yeah. Another pint, Bella. <laughs> so yeah, it's quiet at the minute up here for a change, isn't it? But uh, we've got a nice. Uh, Relaxing view up here. Nice comfy chairs, and they serve beer as well, which is a, an exciting concept. So that's the uh, the country club. Still a little play area through there as well. There we go. So uh, on to the next one. <laughs> right. So we're just leaving the country club. That's the little putting area. Bella's on the way. What are you doing? Are you happy now? Yeah. Jeez. I got, I've got my bike stuck in fence. <laughs> right, off we go. We're going to go down to the beach area now. In the good old days, because I've been coming here 18 years, this used to be a putting green. No, it didn't. A driving range. And funnily enough, somebody must have worked out if they put some big luxury houses on here, they can earn a few more quid than a um, driving range. And lo and behold, that's what we've got now. But uh, we're just saying, anywhere you go in Centre Park, the roads, obviously there's no traffic at all, so kids on the bikes, it's absolutely great. Until they fall off and graze the knees, and then you're in a whole world of pain. Right gears, Bella, right gears. <laughs> <laughs> We've just gone past a, um, a bike track that goes down into the wood, so as well as the, the tracks here, you can venture off and go around the outside. I'll probably put a clip on there with some extra stuff going on. But um, yeah, you can go into the woods and have a play around. Stick it to the left, Bella. Where the hell? Tour de France just coming past us. I'm not sure where you're stopping, but there's places called the tree houses there. Some right fancy houses. They've got actually got some. Um, Pool table there, games room and everything, but uh, very nice. But it's all the places are nice. And off we go down to the beach. So these are the typical houses. I'm not sure which one you stop at again, but um, these are the they're small, but they're still fair size. Aren't they? Look at that! Look at the matchbox. Oh, we'll, we'll go to this side. Okay, alright, whatever Bella, you're in charge. So we just pulled up outside one of the adventure golf places. It's about nine quid for nine holes. And 400 quid for 18, like everything else. But um, up in the trees, if you fancy a bit of high manoeuvring activities, you can do that. It's alright. And basically it takes you right through the forest up to the swing and you go across. There's the Adventure Golf entrance. Nice little 
golf machine. Nice park over here. We've had many, many hours in there, haven't we, Bill? And there's the stuff going through up to the, the top of the, the death slide up there. And another park here. We'll just park up here and show you the beach. So here we are, coming up to the beach area. It's not quite um, Malibu Beach, I suppose, but we'll sit in a minute. But uh, yeah, we're in the beach area, so if it's a nice day, probably about 3,000 kids, but you can fight your way through them. And you've got some canoes and all the water sports, you can do paddle boarding. There's a bit of a boat house here, you can hear all the stuff. So yeah, that's that's the beach area and then there's a pancake house in the distance so you well enough to do pancakes there but you can also do an evening meal yeah do an evening meal there and breakfast but yeah nice when the sun's out like today ish everything just closed up now so they put everything back but uh, yeah that's the beach and the boat house so anything else to say no, that's it for now. Just showing what you can do here. So I've got electric boats. Can't even say that second word. Kayaks, pedalers, paddle boards. Everything you want. 300 quid an hour. Just a quick look at the boats you can hire. You can see the uh, zip wire going across the lake, so thought I'd seen a video of you doing that you just land over there but yeah lovely you'll have a lovely time so that concludes sorry so that concludes a little tour we've done for you just got one little more video to show you of uh, our little lodge we'll do that in a minute hope you enjoy it and have fun so just the last little ending of the video this is our lodge, which is number 55. There we have it. Oh! The end-ish. And there we go. This concludes the video tour of Centre Parks, Sherwood Forest. If you're in Villa 55, this is a view you will have. If you're not, you won't. Enjoy. Okay, quick uh, amendment to the uh, video. When you check out on the last day, you've got to be out of the lodge by 10 o'clock. So you can bring the cars onto the, uh, the park, park up. I think the gates open at um, half six. So if you get early, you can get a good spot. We've packed in, in a tree at the minute, but um, yeah, all packed up. We need to leave by 10 o'clock, but uh, yes, all packed up. Ready for the adventure home. Yippee! So here's the aqua sauna. We just passed it on the way out, but um, yeah, you can easily spend at least a good 30 minutes in there, or longer if you're a lady. Hope you enjoy it and have fun. <laughs> <laughs>